Hey everyone, welcome back to Hi Mama's online activity content hub. Today we are making shape clouds. Look at these fun, fluffy shape clouds. For this activity, you will need a black marker to make your shapes on your paper, a glue stick to glue down your fluffy clouds, some glue construction paper here, and lots and lots of cotton balls. You can also use Q-tips as well. So first thing we're gonna do for this activity is take our blue construction paper. This is going to be the background of our image. Next, we're gonna take our black marker and we're gonna start drawing shapes on the paper. This part can be done by the child as well because they can practice their fine motor skills and holding the marker properly using the pincer grasp and practicing drawing shapes. You can really draw any shape that you want onto your paper. You can even do really intricate images. Make sure they have lots of space to fill up. I'm gonna do a square, a heart, a diamond, a circle, and a rectangle. Notice how there's nice and open spaces inside of the images. Next thing we're gonna do is take our glue stick. You can use a glue stick or you can use white glue as well. Glue stick is a little bit cleaner, but I can assure you that the children will love using the white glue as well if you only have liquid glue. We're gonna take our glue stick and we're gonna get the child to just basically color in the shapes that you've done here. And we're gonna do them one at a time just so our glue does not dry as we go. The next part is the super fun part. Kids love pulling apart things, like love pulling apart the fluff. Their job is to pull apart the cotton balls and place them inside the square, filling up all the negative space inside the image that you've created here. So they're gonna fill up all the shapes. They might have to manipulate the cotton ball into like little balls or long lines to get the edges. And as you talk with the kiddos, you can talk about negative space, which is the white space inside of an image or a shape. You can talk about pulling it apart and making sure they're practicing their fine motor muscles using their pincer grasp, which is their first finger and their thumb. That's gonna really strengthen those muscles. Once they've completed that, they're gonna move on to the next images with the process of the glue stick and the cotton balls. And eventually they will have something that looks like this shape clouds. Go outside and if you can see these in the sky, let us know how your activity went. Have a great day. Bye.